You tune in to CFCR 90.5 FM. Now, you probably know the name Kim Coates, Saskatoon-born actor who's uh, worked with some greats in the business uh, in both film, television, and on stage. Of late, you've probably seen his name come up quite a bit in local media, uh, first for his return to the province to work on some great film projects, uh, such as Ferocious and Rufus, and uh, now he's kind of being thrust into the role of ambassador for the entire Saskatchewan film industry as it fights for its life uh, after some very uh, important cuts to the uh, film employment tax credit. And uh, we've got Mr. Kim Coates on the phone right now who just got back from Africa, believe it or not. Kim, thanks for joining us. Jay, thanks for having me, buddy. Yeah, I, I like to. I, I don't, I'm not sure I'm, I'm the ambassador, but I, I like to think of it as sort of a, a rebel with a cause. Hey, there you go. That's perfect. You know, um, yeah. Listen, we'll get into it in a sec. But yes, I, I literally, my wife and I, Diana, got off a plane yesterday, last night, from from Tanzania, where we went to visit our daughter, who's over there helping save the world in a nonprofit organization called One Heart Source. And it was a it was a bit of a 25 hour plane ride, so I literally just got home, and uh, I'm getting right back on the horse, baby. <laughs> I'm coming back to my province to. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing, but I, I just, I, I know that what is happening is not right, and I, I really want to put a, uh, help put a voice to it. Excellent. Well, and, and I guess the timing was kind of uh, perfect in an imperfect situation that you were, you had come back to the province uh, to work on these uh, film projects, and then this, uh, all this mess started to go down. Well, isn't, isn't that the truth? I mean, how ironic is it that I... I mean, I say no all the time. I'm lucky enough to be in a position to turn work down and to accept two movies in a row, back to back. Yeah. Do you realize in Saskatchewan, I, I, because I've lived in L.A. for so long now, I, I, I'm, a, I'm a proud Canadian, and I'm Canadian first, and I'm a Saskatoon boy first. And I talk about Canada all the time. All the time, my boys down here, Costner, Willis, they're always asking me about Saskatoon and, and about Canada. And I always would talk about the, the prairies in, in the summertime and how freezing it is in the wintertime <laughs> and how beautiful the bridges are in Saskatoon and the people and blah, blah, blah. And now I finally get to discuss movies and this incredible soundstage that we built in Regina, and these incredible writers like, like, like Robert Cuffley and, and David Schultz, who have written these scripts that I wanted to be in and was so happy to be in. And I finished two in a row back to back, and they're going to be amazing films. And all the crew and the people and blah, 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 blah. And, and, and boom, boom, uh, the government decides to stop this, the tax credit incentive. And I'm really trying to stay positive, you know, Jay. I really want to come home uh, Anand Ramaya, my, my good buddy, producer fel, uh, buddy from Saskatoon, t told me what was happening. I literally start filming season five on Tuesday. I'm getting on a plane tomorrow, and this is because I want to come home. I'm paying for it myself. I'm doing everything myself. I want to do this because I'm coming there to see you guys. I'll be I'll arrive midnight Saturday. Sunday we have press uh, all day Sunday. Monday, as you know, we'll talk about it in a sec. I hope, Jay, about yeah. the rally. Yeah. China. I literally get on a, a flight 3 o'clock in the afternoon uh, Monday to be in L.A. late Monday night to start filming Tuesday morning. The producers of Sons of Anarchy said, we really don't want you to go to Saskatoon. And I said, too bad. I'm going. So uh, I don't know what else to say. You I know, just feel that, that we need to, uh, you know, hopefully in the end that, that Brad Wall and, and, and the government will understand what's going on and, and, and support it. Absolutely. And you know, just that your uh, that wonderful rant that you just did just there, it, it, it sounded like it sounded like it was coming from Tig from Sons of Anarchy. You know, that sounds like something Tig would do. Thanks, man. I, I, I you know, they always say that you know, at least from I've done so many movies, right? I've been uh, I've worked so hard in the business that I, 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 I like to distance myself from my, the parts that I play. Yeah, but you have to bring some of yourself to every part sure. you play. And uh, well, I don't know if it sounded like Tig or not. It probably sounded like a guy who just spent 25 hours on a plane. <laughs> but honestly, I, I, like you, Jay, I sp I'm speaking from the heart. And Absolutely. I, I, I love my province, and we just can't let this happen. Fantastic. Well, let's talk about the uh, the specifics then. First, uh, on Sunday night at the Broadway Theater, we've got a film appreciation night, a, a Saskatchewan film appreciation night. It's free of charge. Uh, it starts at 7 p.m., and then that's followed by uh, the culture cruise from Saskatoon to Regina, a kind of bus junket. If you want to drive yourself, you can. If you can only make it to Dundurn and have to drive back for work, you can. 
but uh, they're really looking for people to support uh, this bus trip. It leaves at 7 a.m. Maybe you know the details, Kim. Uh, do you know where where the bus leaves from? I do, Jay. In fact, uh, let me just go back a little bit. Um, sure. First of all, Sunday night at the Broadway Theater, I'm yes. going to get there at 6.30. You're absolutely right. The function starts at 7. It'll be a couple of hours. We're going to pack the people in. Um, I'll be there early to shake some hands, to see some people, take some photos if they want, whatever. Would love to be there a little early, so people want to get there a little early. That, that would be great. Uh, that's Sunday night. And then Monday, we're not farting around. Yeah. It's literally Kinsman Park at 7 a.m. Okay. Um, everyone's to be there at 7 a.m. I'm going to do a CTV morning news show there. There's going to be pancakes served. There's going to be some yoga stretching. We want people on motorcycles, as you said, on buses, cars, trucks, however they want to come and, and help support the rally starting in Saskatoon. Because at 8 o'clock, we're going to roll out of there and, and, and go to Regina. And on the way to Regina, as you just said, we're going to go to Dundurn. There's a photo op in Dundurn. I can't imagine it taking, I mean, if we leave at 8, I'm sure we'll be at Dundurn by 8.10. No, we'll be in Dundurn <laughs> at 8.30, quarter to 9 at the latest, you know, and we're going to have coffee with the mayor there. And, again, there'll be some, some, some press there. And then from there, we're going to go all the way to Regina. So we're encouraging anyone who wants to. There's going to be tons of people to come out and support this culture cruise to Regina. And we're going to go right to the legislature and go right to the steps. And, um, yeah, man. Start making some noise. Rock and roll. Yeah, that sounds great, Kim. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm going to let you get back to uh, recovering. You probably think it's Tuesday of next week right now. So, uh, you're, uh, I'm sure you're jet lagged and, uh, and all that, but I really appreciate you taking this time and, uh, it's a very important cause and I'm hoping everybody can come out and support. Yeah, I think, I think they will Jay. And I'm glad that you're, you're talking to me and thanks for doing that. It means a lot to me. And, uh, cause we love our province and we, we, we can't be, you know, the, 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 the little hillbillies that could, because we're doing it now. All our right. province is rocking now. It's it's our province, and we can't go back to draconian days in the in the arts and culture. We just can't allow that to happen. So, I'm 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 glad that I'm able to to help support a little bit because it means it means the world to me. Right on. Thanks again, Kim. Jay, take care, buddy. All right. And once again, that was Mr. Kim Coates, star of stage and screen, and born right here in Saskatoon, and he's uh, obviously in support of maintaining the uh, film tax credit, uh, film employment tax credit here in Saskatchewan. So uh, once again, Saskatchewan Film Appreciation Night, Sunday, 7 p.m., Broadway Theatre. Arrive a little bit early if you'd like to meet and or greet Kim Coates, and uh, that's all free. Then the next day, you can uh, get up early and take part in the Culture Cruise bus trip leaving from Kinsman Park. The uh, festivities start at 7 a.m., and the bus leaves at 8 and once again, it's Monday the 14th. Take part, participate, make your voice heard. We sure support it here at CFCR, so you should too. 90.5 FM. Stay tuned.